Today I'm here to show you how to fix the 3149 error on iTunes. You're going to need two things. Obviously, iTunes and Tiny Umbrella. It's going to be a, um, I'll put the version down in the description and you're going to need the newest version of iTunes. And see, the problem with the 3149 error is it, won't, it will not allow you to update to 5.0 or 5.0.1. But I know how to fix that problem. I know there may be tons of other videos for this, but I want to make a video so I'm kind of a contribu contribution to that. Okay, first of all, you're going to open up Tiny Umbrella, run it. This is for Windows. There's a different one for Macs. Mac is just the same thing, just different process. Alright, we'll let Tiny Umbrella load. Okay. Um, advanced. You're going to go over to Advanced on your settings down at the bottom for iPod. Just ignore that blog thing. Go to Advanced. You're going to go not the first one, not the second, to the third one. Mine's already unchecked. But when you go down there, it's going to be checked like this. What you're going to do is you're going to uncheck it. And after that, you just close up your uh, tie umbrella. You're going to go down. It's going to restore your computer. I'm not going to restore it because I mean restart it. I'm not going to do that because I've already done it. And after you restart it, you're going to go to iTunes and it would just it'll just allow you like take my word for it trust me um, you go down to iPod update and there is a trick I'm gonna plug in my other iPod touch see I could be on a newer firmware but I really don't feel like downloading at the moment but um see I'm just gonna plug in my other iPod give me a minute Okay, iPod, I just plugged in, it'll show up on iTunes in a second, um, oops, uh, there we go, my sis, um, it's kind of my sister's iPod, we kind of share it, but this is my iPod I'm filming with, I let her use it sometimes, but it's actually mine, um, you go, here's a trick, you go down, you're gonna hold shift, you would hold shift, um, be like, you click check update, and if it was regular update, you just go down. If you have any IPSWs, those are uh, down, um, iPad, iPhone, iPad, iPod softwares. Um, they have this one, I have 4.3.5, 5.0.1, I have tons of other ones. I have um, hmm. I have them somewhere, but um, you could choose your firmware if you don't if you don't feel like downloading it. Like if you've already downloaded it somewhere else, or you could restore it to your original firmware. I won't let you restore it lower or higher. You could click Shift, restore, and I you'd have to back it up and then so um, yeah the three one four nine error will not come up. I promise you. You have my word. Um, you may have an error on your maybe your computer that it may not work, but if you if everything on your computer is going well, um, it'll work. Um, comment, subscribe, tell me how it worked for you. If you have any questions or anything, uh, let me know. And um, just to get the word out, um, if anyone could, uh, I'm a huge fan of iCrack your device, iDevice. Um, if any of you could uh, tell them to give me a PM or something, I really need to talk to him about something. But um, other than that, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, like, subscribe, and um, I'll have more videos coming. Thanks for watching. Bye.